people are, are, are watching on the, on the YouTubes. But it's, it's continuing on. It is one of those ones, again, where right now we kind of poking a little fun at it, and we're just kind of like, ha, 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 he's doing his thing. But the other side of that coin is these things could turn really quick, and that is the reason why he's turning again. I feel like I've been here before. I feel like I've been here before. Yeah, is he going to make a left turn this time? What's that? Oh, oh, got? What is oh, this? The cops. What is this? The cops are it back on it. might actually turn into yeah, a pursuit, guys. Goes. You see? Y your patience paid off. Your patience paid off. What's that, pussycat? Whoa, 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 whoa. The, the uh, area is clear in front of that vehicle. Another thing, since the suspect pussycat, is staying in the pussycat. same area, uh, what happens is they actually get a lot more units in the area, and they can think about a spike strip. If he continues to make circles around the same area that he's sort of done, make a right turn. I think it might be on Garfield Avenue once again, going southbound. Uh, so when that happens, they have the opportunity to get units uh, in position to use a spike strip. And now we have the suspect coming down towards a signal light that is red, and Ooh. there is stopped traffic. So you see him making a, a abrupt Ooh, turn to go alley. down. Oh. Oh, into an area. He could have hit somebody. He, just went the other. he was going the other direction structure. down that lane. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I'm too big on the screen. Uh, opposite here. direction, and now he's headed that way. Guy. So it's the smaller. longer it stays here, the more patrol units you're going to see in the Ooh, area. The then they'll have the chance to do the pit maneuver, maybe in a spike strip, and get this over with. Well, then you also think that if he continues to like get in the same area, they is. can close that intersection. You know, they can have officers but here we go again now he's driving yep. into oncoming traffic uh officers are behind him um but this is this is where it gets really scary for uh anybody who Ooh. might be driving because and again it's such an yeah. odd thing that he keeps going in the same space but now really picking up speed yeah patrol cars at every corner now and if he makes a left turn here he'd be back seeing in that exact same spot but now we're we're on garfield headed northbound we were southbound yeah, a moment so ago much. there are multiple patrol cars behind the vehicle and as you mentioned now the speed has picked up quite a bit we might be able to bring it up on our awesome, speed really? tracker and get a, a good pretty good estimate of how fast he's going uh, but certainly well above the speed limit and unfortunately through some red lights the patrol cars are still right behind though it's interesting how different jurisdictions have different policies and procedures and uh, how aggressive they might be in trying to stay with a suspect the like this but the patrol car is pretty close to him right behind him open up a little bit marcel and it gives you an idea how far behind the patrol car is and i think in a situation like this if he slows again on one of these turns they're going to use a pit maneuver they just have to make sure that there's nobody on the sidewalk there's nobody that could be hit because it can be extremely dangerous so welcome to all the new people um this chase has been going on for a little bit I missed it because I was out at a grocery store a little further away than normal because I like that store better. But this guy's been driving nuts, starting, stopping. At, at some point, they even called it off. They let they were going to let him go because he was driving so erratic. I think he was driving into oncoming traffic on the wrong way. And, and now I guess they re-engaged. They're going to make him go like that way now. Stolen vehicle. Yeah, it looks like it. And I think they're going to use a spike strip here if he stays in this area pretty soon. Or the pit maneuver, if he doesn't speed up, we'll just have to see um, how this proceeds. But they certainly here in Alhambra have decided they're going to they're going to get on this. Well, that's one thing, Scott. You mentioned jurisdictions treat things differently, and pr there's another officer right there on the side of the street. And, and and the thing is, he wasn't leaving Alhambra's jurisdiction at that point. You he was initially on the 710. He was going all over the area. Sheriffs were following, and CHP was following him. So they decided all collectively to pull back when he was driving Ooh, erratically. Oh, I thought the cop was going to hit that guy chosen to stay in Alhambra and make this him. loop that he keeps going around and Alhambra may have just decided collectively as an agency this is too dangerous for our community and we're going to try to put a stop to it and, and, and they have the with the, had the officers sure. being able to kind of corral this person by putting him in various places and you're right he's coming up on some of these corners and he's going to have to slow down and they might be able to pit him it's possible, and he's just staying in the same yeah, area right now, just uh, one street over from Garfield Avenue, which he was southbound on. He's southbound once again, and, um, you know, the longer this goes on and stays in this one area, Buster the more patrol cars, the more units they'll have in the area, and the Thank better the 20 they'll be memberships. able to uh, no try and uh, stop this and sort of dictate what happens a little bit more. Uh, but right now, it's, it's to the point, unless they do the pit maneuver, and boy, right through Garfield Avenue there at a pretty high rate of speed. You see the patrol car, you didn't see it, but he stopped mm -hmm. for safety. He wasn't willing to go through there. And now he has pulled over, so uh, I haven't heard on the radio, but they may have decided to back off on go? this again because oh. the patrol cars that were right behind the suspect to? have now backed off. Right, they right. backed off completely. And right, I understand an air unit might be back.
Let's do it. You can see it right there. Stolen vehicle. Now, this started in the Lakewood area, and it got onto the freeway. The sheriff's Austin, department was in, in pursuit Amazing. of that vehicle. Uh, basically got on that 710 and rode the 710 till the end. Then he got onto, onto surface streets. Sheriff's department let it go. They said, you know what? It, it, it's a stolen vehicle, and uh, we have other things to do. So they kind of just let it go. But that vehicle. Is this the one that they said was there were, I thought there was somebody wanted for meth, but I don't know if it's this guy. San Gabriel. Now, Alhambra like, PD, they got behind it, they lit it up, and then this person behind the wheel, they started driving even more recklessly, and you can see some of that right there. Running a lot of red lights, a lot of sharp turns, sure, and of course, nice. it's that slowing down, speeding up, and then cutting those corners. Ooh, that was a sharp I, I'm turn. not sure what's going on right there, but he seems like he's having a harder time controlling uh, that little Ford pickup truck. Boy, it, in the himself. beginning, he was kind of making these turns. He was was cutting the corners tight but now you can see it a couple times right there he, he's going wide he's cutting it too short and then he's losing that it's law enforcement when in, in any type of situation well it's it's uncomfortable to watch because he's in residential neighborhoods right and it's yeah. um you know noon right now kids are on spring break you know depending on which school district but there are people out and about and it makes you nervous when you're seeing this guy drive recklessly <clears throat> It, it, definitely. And, you know, when he, when you see these, like, right there, that's another one. That was a, on the wrong side of the road. Of course, yeah. he's only going about 30 right now. But he makes these hard turns. He gets these high oh. speeds. And he gets so close, close to close, so many yeah. of these other folks. He hasn't swapped any paint as far as we can see. But he's come very, very close uh, more than a couple of times. At one point earlier on, we actually saw this guy cut somebody off on a turn, on making a right turn. And uh, that person was chasing him down for a little bit. I thought we might actually see some actual California road rage, but uh, that driver backed off eventually oh, no. as well. But this uh, driver, driving. very reckless, and of course, you know, we like poking a little fun at these things, but it's not really fun, like you said, when there's so many people out on the roadway. This kind of stuff okay. right there, wrong side of the road, and it, these are blind corners. You know, it could be, it could be one of, you know, it could be one of my children or a family member just driving along and then you've got this guy coming around the wrong side of the road and then you have a head-on collision you just don't want to see anybody get hurt Al alhambra pd clearly they've backed off as well but this driver yeah. continues to drive very recklessly in their town running another red light out there at least there wasn't a lot of traffic okay so to be clear you're saying they've backed off meaning at this moment do we have any police cruisers following this guy or is, are we just observing to see what his next move is going to be we are just observing. It, is, it almost might be what we call a media pursuit, meaning we're following mm. it. We're keeping an eye on it. But as far as law enforcement down there, I would venture to say that they have actually backed off, backed off. I'm doing a wider shot right now, and I know that this department doesn't have any kind of air. Uh, um, we, I, I'm sorry. I thought I was, it was a scanner. Um, it, it, so they don't have any air support. So there is no uh, PD helicopter calling this out. There was just the guys on the ground, the guys and gals on the ground down there from the Alhambra PD and doing what they could to get this uh, vehicle to come to, a, come to a stop. But right now, you see his slower speeds and uh, back into the residential neighborhood. Like, again, this, if it's just a stolen vehicle, why doesn't this person just pull over, get out of the car, and just walk away? Well, let's see. It looks like he's pulling into a lot oh. right there, uh -oh, right? Oh, here we go. And yes. let's see. Oh, back reversing. Up. Hey, what's going on here? We got somebody just kind of standing there. I don't what know the hell, Bubba? Is, clearly doesn't have a shirt on. Why is he waving it at the person? He's waving this guy on. Like, like they know each other. Whoop, what the heck? Whoop, whoop, whoop. What's going on oh, there? Oh, he was about to hit that car. Was no, to come I don't. In. I, yeah, somebody's trying to come oh, in. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, Jesus oh, Christ. Oh, there you go. There you so the go. guy standing there with a shirt off must be like, a, what the heck? No, no. What, what's you better move out the way. I'm not even sure, but there's a, there's a wire a flopping around down there now as oh, well. So making his way back out there. Oh, Back on the case there. That would have been a. So clearly, they, you know, hopefully they're watching and, and, and keeping an eye on what's going on. Maybe they're, hopefully they're watching our feed. And what the? 
And the what sheriff's the helicopter is returning uh, the- now uh, after they had uh, walked away from this earlier on. They're coming back right now. So they are going to start. They're going to reacquire it. They're going to be calling this out, keeping an eye on it, and allowing or helping out the smaller agency down there. This is going to be Alhambra PD, possibly to give them an idea where this thing is, where it's going. But this stuff right here, this is where I start to get really, really tense. Yeah, he's and, got, he can you kill know, somebody high easily. Speeds, he's you know, it, it, it is a bigger street, clearly. It's Garfield. But you just... Even it, you just don't want to see anything happen bad. Oh God! Look and at that. Uh, making a wide turn, making a U turn, and this Whoa. is what I'm saying. It's like this guy or gal is almost taunting officers. Uh, before we before we went live, I said it, and uh, you know, is it appropriate? But it almost seems like this driver wants to spend the night in jail, and hmm. and I hope it's going to be jail and not in a hospital because it seems like he's like, look, I, I, you know, I know those officers are this way. So I'm making a yeah. U-turn to go get behind them. And now I'm going to drive even rec- more recklessly. What I, it is, is it's, Damn. it's dumbfounding to, to wow, watch those these type too. of chases. Crazy. Well, you know, Stu, we also don't know uh, this vehicle, person yeah. could be under the influence of something. Who knows? That is a possibility. We have no idea. Uh, another thing, I don't know if it's clear or not, if there is more than one person in this vehicle. Do we have confirmation of that? Is it just the driver? Well, we've been kind of peeking in there a couple of times. This is the first one. See, this is what I'm saying. This Whoa. person Whoa. is just yeah. driving reckless to drive Whoa. reckless. There's there's no, there's no, nothing. There's no reason for this. There's no, well, well maybe, maybe there was. Maybe he saw the fire truck. But at any rate, now he's making what? another U-turn. He had an officer right over so here erratic. in his way c- coming right behind the tree of course but uh so there there's the officer i was talking about but it, it is almost like this driver is taunting these officers right. and and again you just got to wonder what is going on in this guy's mind gal's mind and as far as anybody in that who's in the, the car as far as we could see uh, it is just the driver in there uh we were we were using the you know the tools in skyfox to look in the window earlier on and it, it appears that this driver is in that vehicle by himself and and I have to say the roads are quite kind of wide open at this point, right? Um, wow. Not that much traffic, but still it's dangerous because of the way he's driving, he or she is driving, and the speed in which this driver's driving. But it's pretty wide open. Well, luckily, luckily we up, don't huh? see a lot of traffic out there. When he gets on the majors, though, there are other cars. We watch this guy pass a number of other vehicles going on the wrong side of the road. Not right there, the but getting away. this is, a, again, on a, on a smaller street out here in the San Gabriel Valley, but we're still in Alhambra. But you, you see these where he... Like just kind of fishtails the truck for no reason at all. Now back on the wrong side of the road. That's a solid red right there, going right through that solid red. And you got a number of people just kind of you know on the on the corners. And I almost wonder if they're watching this somehow because he does make his way through these neighborhoods. Like he's been making a lot of blocks right now. Maybe not so much, but we've watched this guy make a block at where this uh, uh, parking garage was. He went through there probably four times. And actually had the officers chase him through that parking garage because I thought, you know, we've seen it in the past. They'll drive to a parking garage, they'll park the car and walk away. This guy didn't park the car. He just kept it going. So we're going to keep an eye right here. I don't know if it's possible if we can do a split screen. Yo, look at the guy waving at him like earlier. he's pissed because okay, the so guy. Let's take a look. He's pissed because he didn't stop. And so the guy was like, and the other car was waving his hand at him like, yo, what the, what's your problem? And I thought that cop car was about to hit that red car too. It's pretty wild. Cool. And then right below, you see How what we saw too. earlier, just more <sighs> reckless driving. Did you stop right now, um, Stop the, the middle driver of the road. just doesn't stop left care, going through stop think, signs, what? red lights, Guy on a bike. cutting things Thanks. close. Um, okay, so that that's what we're dealing with. And we can go back to currently what's happening where this truck has just come yeah. to a stop. And come to a stop. And he did see, he never came to a complete stop, but he came, he, he almost came to a stop on the 710 earlier on. Just brought, you know, brought it down to below 30 miles an hour at one point on the northbound 710. And then just, and then from there proceeded to go 80 miles an hour. So I, and I'm, I'm hearing it right now is that Alhambra PD also, they're just, you know, they're probably watching what we're seeing. And they, they are also saying this is just too dangerous for our officers to be to pursue this person right now. And so they are canceling as well. So again, it's going back to this. We're just going to keep an eye on it. Um, I'm not sure if the, uh, if the 
the PD, how the, the Sheriff's Department is going to stay and keep an eye on it as well, maybe relay the information back and forth between the uh, between Alhambra PD and the Sheriff's Ship just to get an idea where this guy is. If it comes to a stop, maybe they'll be able to take him into custody. But again, this is a second agency that has basically Allie, said this person is too dangerous. School's watching it is chase. just a stolen vehicle as far as we know. Lunch. We're just going to let it go. Oh. Oh, see? my gosh. Mm. See, that Thankfully, this guy stopped. Pedestrian. At least he yep. stopped. Me too. He or she stopped. Um, yep. You know, when we talk about what it takes when law enforcement makes that decision, whether or not to pursue the pursuit, <coughs> so to speak, um, it really is just about taking into consideration how this could impact the innocent pedestrians, innocent drivers, and they take into account, is it worth pursuing this person or is this person so reckless that us pursuing this individual puts the community more so at risk? You know, those are the questions, and I, I was talking to Jeff's my pilot today, and uh, Jeff, if you guys don't know, I'm sure everybody does, is uh, is former law enforcement, and I, I was being serious. I said I would love to sit down with a with a watch commander and just ask them the questions, like where, why, why are you canceling it? What is what is the reason behind it? That would be interesting. It? Yeah, to get an interview. And, with them? and you know, and it seems like they at night the chases continue on, but in the daytime, you know, the the, the day watch guys, they're just more sensitive to the publics mm. or the or the the folks that are out on the road and they they'll cancel yeah, all the maybe? time uh, but in this case Drolling. you can see it right there you got a number of people everybody's wow, got their cell this. phone out so you kind of know that they're watching they you know they're probably viewers our viewers right down there and they're keeping an eye on this as well but the reasoning i i i, I wonder <laughs> where where the line is drawn or what what weighs into those decisions of public safety and then also doesn't the lights and sirens help warn the public? Right. Uh, you know, we talk about often how these um, pursuit suspects go to areas they're somewhat familiar with or neighborhoods they know. Um, we don't know if that's the case because just how, uh, how random it has been thus far. But it's interesting to me that now this driver keeps stopping, almost like thinking, what's my next move? Which direction should I turn? Should I go left? Do I go right? It makes me believe as though he or oh she boy. is not familiar with this area. Familiar or perhaps uh, taunting officers. Uh, That's that, what I think. that might be the other side of it. Maybe coming to a stop, <laughs> basically saying, you know, here I am, Ollie Ollie Oxen Tree, come get me. <laughs> Uh, and it, that actually just showed how old I am. But at any rate, <laughs> it, 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 it's one of those ones where, you know, he's kind of waiting oh, to see Rolling. if officers will, will come and find yeah. him and then maybe re Because before I went live to, I heard he was doing that at some lights. He'd go to a red light and, like, just stop and just stay there. It, it would turn green, so he just just stop and wait. Do those stops, and then he continues to go again, and now I'm hearing that the actual sheriff ship itself has departed the area, so wow. they, they, they are not here either. Oh, he's got to go back the other way. I hope I didn't lose him because that's a right dead there. end street. Oh, he's going through the parking, the parking, gr parking lot. lot down there. There he is. Yeah, thank you, guys. Um, but uh, that's a dead end street, so clearly not using uh, any kind of navigation because he made a mm. turn onto that road right there. But uh, this is the thing. It's like where, you know, where do they draw the line? Where does, uh, where does law enforcement get back into it? And then, of course, it, it, as far as public safety goes, is this being safe by not trying to bring this person to a stop? Well, that's my question. So let's right now they're backing off, right? They're going to just like yes. let it be. OK, D are they truly letting it be or are they keeping an eye uh, from a distance to then like swoop in? Like, how does this work? <clears throat> well, uh, it, it hopefully they're watching us and uh, and they're, you know, and they're seeing the location. So maybe that's what they're doing right now. As far as the sheriff's Oops. helicopter that was helping Alhambra PD, that helicopter has backed off uh, it, it, and left, went back to patrolling. So there is no law enforcement in the air and apparently no law enforcement. Well, there's an officer right there. Uh -huh. You saw those brake right lights there. come on. So he knows that that is the, sub, uh, uh, the subject, the suspect. So possibly they are just kind of hanging out in the area. We, uh, you know, we just don't see them. But uh, how they keep an eye on them, that's a different story. But at any rate... That's that's what's going on, but the speeds definitely picking up once again. Up you again kept, yeah. then, this is not a 
an anomaly. This guy's going almost 80 miles an hour, wow. going around a car that was coming out to make a turn, and we're on Garfield. You know, yeah, it's a bigger street, but you go, you're on the wrong. And, and I wonder what set this guy off. Is it just seeing the cop that drove by him, or he you know, not seeing the helicopter up in the air? Is that uh, really, truly? That's when I start to worry because that's okay. the parking garage that Park he seems to like so much. We're back. We're back at that parking garage. So uh, you saw him make a turn into that p parking garage. We'll see what happens now. We'll see. We'll check, keep keep an eye on all those sides. Everybody watching with us, please, and even the alleyway to see if uh, he does pop back out. But uh, he, we just saw him make that turn. He's back out. That's there him. he is again. Yeah, that's him right there. So it, this up. is one of those ones where you just kind of wonder uh, why does this continue? Kids. Why does he keep doing this? Yeah, good... what, where was that? There's there someone in the so backseat. People there. Oh no, it's just trash, like I guess. A... Uh, it looks like it's. It looks like it's just a shopping area oh, out okay. here in the Alhambra area. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm, not, that I'm not. He or she hasn't okay. jumped on a freeway. Well, it started on the 710. At the well, we were on the 710 earlier on. Uh, it in we were. It started in the Lakewood area. Got on the 710. They took the 710 till it dead ended into the valley, uh, Valley Boulevard. And then after that, it, it's been on it's been on streets out here ever since. Yeah, so. it makes no sense, huh? None of I it see. does. Um, but you're right. You know, again, we go, yeah, I saw that super close, close calls, a lot of close calls. Yeah, and 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 those hard turns for no real reason. It's like he almost wants to lose control. Uh, he did another one right there. You can't really see it, but he just cut somebody off. He he went around them to make that right turn. And I also think there might have been somebody at that corner. There might have been a pedestrian out there because I just I got a glimpse of something. But see, this is what I'm saying. It's like all these kind of close calls. Another uh, red light right there. Another Whoa. car just you know just backing out of a driveway. It. Right, and right. You just don't. split second. <sighs> Uh, the, the, I mean, yeah. this person just blowing through these stop signs, like not even slowing down to blow through them, just going straight through without any consideration. Right there. Yeah, 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 that's wild. Yeah. That's it's wild. Just even really break, a scary yeah. situation because they don't seem to care. Yeah, they don't seem to care at all. And I almost, I, I, I want to push in on those motorcycles right there. I, I, like I said, I'm not really good with Alhambra, but I, I hope that's not the police department right there. Because it does seem like there's, uh, look at that. He got mm -hmm. air. Man. He got mm -hmm. air yeah. on that one. Uh, so it, it, it is clearly, this person is extremely reckless, seems to be taunting officers. And right now, nobody's biting. So hopefully this person is going to get bored with, the, with their own activities and then just kind of call it quits. Or, you know, something is, something's going to happen. Maybe, you know, maybe the truck is going to run out of gas or who knows. Or maybe, uh, hopefully, no, and that's another thing, too. We've seen it so many times in the past where people are watching and they're like, you know, I'm going to go out there and I'm going to take care of this problems. We don't want to see that either, and law enforcement doesn't want to see that either. So right now, just uh, we'll keep an eye on them. They've got another solid red. It looks like he's tr he's behind the trees. So this, if something's going to happen. It's going to happen right there. <laughs> it's, it's, it's just my luck. But right. uh, that pickup truck coming, just basically showing up, and, and look, that's, that light just turning red, mm -hmm. so he ran another red light as he made that turn. I mean, I don't want to say getting lucky, but it, I guess people are getting lucky to avoid him or her, and this driver is getting lucky in the sense that nothing crazy has happened so far because there have been so many close the, calls, it's insane. Note of the road. Pretty well, driver. And, and very well put. You know, you, when you... When you uh, it's just mental health, I guess. Around. Uh, Substances. Not the driver of that vehicle. It's the other people, the the civilians yeah. that are nearby, the innocent people. They're the ones. Their luck is the one that that is holding on. Uh, at least he didn't run that red light. Well, what probably wasn't red enough. So, anyways, he's making another turn. We're staying in these neighborhoods, slowing down once again, and uh, we'll Creeping. keep an eye on him the best we can. Sky Fox moving around there. There's a lot of uh, a lot of traffic out here, a lot of interest for oh, sure. Okay. So that might be one of the reasons why we're not right up with him. But uh, at this point, we're just going to keep an eye. We haven't had, a, we never lost him. But uh, you know, there's been a lot of times where he's been behind a couple of uh, the trees or behind a building here or there. But uh, whoop, that's not him. See, that's what I was oh, worried about. I that was Son him. of a gun. No? Oh, now everybody's going to have to help me find him. <laughs> so oh, I thought that was oh, him. Was that I don't know looked, where he went. Uh oh. Yeah, it looked, it looked like yeah, the same truck, the, huh? Yeah, it's not, though, so i got to try to find him. I'm going to work with Jeff ABC here in a minute. Jeff, do we have any idea where he might be? 
All right, we're all looking you right now. You know, it's interesting. When we were on the street a moment Tried ago, on I did pursuit. see. They really would it's, have uh, the ability if he stays in this I think ABC area, still has it. So uh, officers here so, have it. Uh, so that they might be able to try that spike strip and at least get him slowed down and get this over with. Well, we're continuing okay. to watch this. We're going to follow it for just a couple of more minutes uh, to see how this developed. Other than that, we would probably eventually just release this to uh, let, let us return to regular programming and, and let law enforcement do what they're going to do. Because at this point, it's just been a series of us following this vehicle, uh, driving around, very much putting the community at you risk with his uh, ways of driving. But for now, and again, I, Scott, I, I, I would totally agree with you. You, you can't second guess this law was enforcement so because wild. this is what a good hit? idea oh, generally to just back yeah, off because electrical. most of these oh. suspects Settle down, drive safely, and eventually just get rid of the vehicle. Well, not and really an electric go back I don't know what's to, on there. Look, you know, it did have some wires. like they can get away. I don't know if it's electricity uh, But this or person, or unfortunately, has not really decided to drive safely. Were those not motorcycle traffic, um, not lanes. officers there on the side there? Motorcycle officers, so they're kind of far they behind the feet. Officer feeds. there, that was a spot. Oh, they found him again. They found him again. Backed up into that telephone pole okay. that we just saw a moment ago. So that gives you an idea. He's just staying in the oh, exact. Oh, the cops right on him. Okay, cops back on it. Okay, so where Wait, are, are they showing replays? This... Okay, oh, this is earlier replays. as well. This is when. All right, they're still showing replays. I think. I'll keep up with ABC for now. Those at this point in time, uh, but uh, law enforcement still is content to just completely back off on this individual and uh you know as you mentioned hopefully he makes a run ABC for it, has like a real big delay there would no longer really be a threat but i believe this okay happens. scott well we are just about going to wrap this thing up oh, you oh, see look a couple you that? Of, see th therein is another so, part of this process you see these people getting yeah. upset and engaged uh but we've got about 20 seconds left in this scott so we're going to wrap our coverage up of this we will continue to monitor it, and we will let you know if anything uh, oh develops that is necessary. Uh, but along with Scott Wright, this has been Philip Palmer uh, and a pursuit suspect. Uh, but at this yeah, point, we're going to, to turn this back over to the authorities, and we will cover more Perfect. if things develop and need to provide it for you. So we'll Perfect. return you to programming now. Thanks for watching. Yep. I think they're going to leave it here, though. So it looks like ABC still has them. Unless they're just really behind. Jay, we're going to try for Burbank. Yeah, we, we have to go. All right. So I guess it looks like they still have. I guess they won't have any commentary. That's fine. Um, oh, did it still find them again? Oh, no, it's not. They're still looking. All right, let me leave it here for now, I guess. Give me one second. Let me just grab a drink. He's right there, though. He's right there. Yeah, Fox 11 lost him. And I think ABC might be leaving. Is there any other network that's out there? Are they all just kind of calling it off? All right, let's listen to ABC's calling it. And so Grant is actually behind us. So we went too far. That's Alhambra. Oh, oh my gosh. This is middle, middle oh, street. That, that's For North no apparent Stoneman. reason, it stopped so probably Stoneman's about right three here. times. And North on TBS Stoneman. is live. I think everybody lost that's them. Stoneman. That's Stoneman and Grand. So he's got to be somewhere right up in here. Uh, let's and see if we can spot him. And I still don't see him. That's Stoneman and McLean. Um, okay. Oh, gosh. Okay. Alhambra. All right. Okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, okay. That's right here. Oh, oh no, no. And Come you on. said he just burned out. 
Okay, but... Okay. He's he on McQueen. Uh, northbound turn. That's up. Back over this way. Come on, Stu, let's get it. To the right. Um, right. Stu, it looks like he pulled into like a uh, gas station of some sort and made a uh, making a run for it. No. Back in the car. I think he gets ba back. Back in the car. He's where, back where, where? In the car. Back in the car. Mm, that was odd. It was a. Uh, where? It looks like a gas station. Um, I can't make it out though. Nine o'clock. And it is in fact McLean. a male driver. That much we can confirm. Coming out to Garfield. Alhambra, where the heck's Garfield? Coming out to Garfield. All right. Alhambra and Garfield. I wonder if okay, like guys, this. hang on. Just okay. just letting you know so, that you guys are... So, Stu, while you uh, you try to find this uh, pursuit suspect, we'll let you get to it. Um just keep us posted. Um, in the meantime, though, since the police have backed off anyway from this, we're going to send you back to your regularly scheduled programming. Keep an eye on all of this, and if anything transpires, we'll check back in. Um, all right, and uh, we'll have more, of course, later on this afternoon uh, during the Fox 11 News at 5 o'clock. Is that him? That's him right there! Hello? Pursuit suspect. We'll let you get to it. Just keep us posted. Oh, okay. about all that. Time, though, so we, we, we clearly you can see how difficult it is up here, and and yeah. also everybody's trying to help, and I love everybody's help. Trust me. So, so he got it back. Is that right? Oh Let's my gosh. Ugh. Oh. I think what part of the problem is is that you guys are you guys are dealing with a delay. The delay. But I do any kind of help is a good help. Thank you, Melissa. I appreciate it. And Kevin, if you're still out there, thank you, man. I would venture to say you're probably hearing it on the scanner. Okay. Yeah. KTL. Has it as well. Yeah, they do have it. Not well. It's all good. I, I won't lose them again. I'm trying to find out. Trying to. All right, oh, so, man, it's all good. So we have a backup. KTLA does look clear. That's what makes the job the job. If we didn't, run, we weren't doing the job. <laughs> you know what I mean? But I know people like Stu's commentary. <laughs> this guy's still going, running from himself. There's no That's cops. What, that's that's basically what what we're finding out. There's there's law enforcement out here, you know. I mean, they're 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 nearby. That's for sure. But yeah, they 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 told the sheriff ship to leave. Well, they didn't say, "Hey, leave. We don't want your help." But they said, "We're not going to chase them anymore, so we don't need your assistance." Uh oh. So they they really they. Well, they probably not <laughs> probably not using us anymore after that debacle. But hang on, I won't lose them, I promise. There's a cop right there. See what I'm saying? Mm. So uh, we'll, we'll see what happens. Oh, it might but be in for a long one. I guys. think he knows this area because he stays here. I don't know. And he seems to like that gas station. Maybe he needs gas. Yep, there we go. Oh. Back to the gas station. Maddie just starts filling up. <laughs> Now's the time to go get some gas. Get some gas. Yeah, yeah the cops. Maybe grab a Coke. The cops. Oh, he parks like I do. Maybe he's going to run inside. I really think he's, I think he's really messes with, he's, he's, he's doing this. He's taunting the officers, which is is not good. <clears throat> Barbara, thank you for the membership. Gracias. Right. 
Right. Gypsy Lola, thank you for the 20 months. It's yes, Mel. It, Chase. It's just... Hey, Trey, Caroline, thank you for the 13 months. Amazing. And he Gypsy continues Lola, to Super do like, like that. Now, he, now he's like literally on the wrong side of the road just, just to be on the wrong side of the road. There's no reason. Yeah. Seriously, it's not like there's cars blocking him, so he there has to go. the wrong way. Then you could you could have been yelling out the window. He's over there. He's over there. It's that one. It's that one. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh boy, <laughs> what's this guy doing? I guess he wants to make a left. He's going to wind up getting into an accident. And yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's, uh, Lakewood. No, then Lakewood. Oh, look, look at that guy doing guy. a wheelie. Uh, oh, stun. It, you, you know these people are watching on the internet. You know they are. Boy, you stun. know they're watching on the internet. Boy, be careful of playing around like that. I'm going to run your ass over. Yeah. <laughs> well, we... <laughs> I might be I might be committed after all this too, right? So Yeah. Are we still on the internet? Kids? See. Yes. Si. After that debacle? All right. Well, so now I got a few minutes to say uh is, I'm sorry. Oh, we're on KCAL also. Okay, copy all. Uh it it's it's. Uh, I, I just want to say sorry about that. We did lose the car there for a minute. And then when I say we, that one really was me. That was all me. That wasn't. Uh, it, that wasn't a team effort. Uh, but uh, you Ooh, can see right this. now that this guy is really starting to get popular out in Alhambra because everybody seems to be talking to him. Uh, he had some guy on a motorcycle doing uh, wheelies next to him, and you know that person was just out there just for the fact that. They know that this is on the internet. Again, this is one of those ones. It's 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 you know these are the things that like again law enforcement they have to deal with this. Are are we helping? Are we hindering? It's a tough call. Um, right now though, this guy continues to con you know just drive around doing a couple blocks out here in the Alhambra area. I know for a fact that if I knew somebody out here, I would say hey. You might not want to be driving in, in, in this area right now just because the odds are a little higher that something could happen. But uh, he just continues to be making these blocks right there. Another red light. You know, that guy in that black car, he's, he, he's probably Ooh. got a couple of choice words for that uh, guy driving in the truck. I, and he's back over to the unlimited station. oil. Whoa. Good prices, by the way, at unlimited oil. If you're looking for cheap gas, I think Food for Less and Unlimited Oil are probably the two best places to get gas. And if you're a, <laughs> if you're a Kroger guy, you know, then uh, you're paying a little bit oh, less. Oh, wow. A Anyways, he's, uh, he, he pulls in, he pulls oh, out, he pulls in, he pulls out. It's, uh, it, it, it is just, uh, just another day out here in Alhambra. But uh, these guys at the gas station clearly don't know what's going on. I... A little worried. We haven't seen this guy do anything aggressive like that, but he keeps going into that gas station. Mm. And you know people at the gas station, a lot of times you leave your car running, you know, push to start, go mm. fill it up, just kind of leave it alone. Maybe maybe he's trolling. Maybe he's trolling for another ride. I, I hope not. That's the only thing I got to say. Anyway... <clears throat> The Rangers back on the back on the. Candle, thank you for the nine months. There's another day in California. Here in a few minutes, maybe even sooner. Made another U-turn right there. And uh, make sure you, make sure you guys hit the, the like button too. Continue. Subscribe. That's Please. the best way to put it. Gracias, and sub to the second channel as well, please. I don't know what this guy's doing, man. And he keeps doing these, like, speeding up to go around the corner. Look at all these guys. They're all just watching. Mm -hmm. They're all just watching him. <clears throat> Coming back around, and uh, I promise I won't lose him. I know. They're like, Stu, you said that before. Yeah. I know.
Good gas mileage on that Ford Ranger. That's what I, how I understand it. Good gas mileage. Good gas mileage. <clears throat> but he really likes to hammer it when he goes around that those corners. Hey, look at that. Is there a gas station over here at this corner? Oh, oh. First time we went past it in a while. So I saw somebody who's tagged me on Twitter. Uh, speeds are picking up. One. Somebody mentioned this in the chat as well. I haven't seen this yet. It says, heartbreaking in California. A trailing new helicopter footage. Savannah Grazano, Graz, Grazano, a teenage kidnapping victim, is tragically shot dead by police while running towards them for help. Despite one of the officers' desperate pleas to follow deputies to fellow deputies to stop shooting her. Oh my God, what the hell? There he is. Nope, that's not him. Oh, no. Uh, where him? the heck did he go? He went, I saw him going he was over here. He made a U-turn. Oh. Yeah, he made that's a U-turn. And I he just put it in that park. Yet. Now he put it in reverse. Wow. How do you know that, Stu? Did you see how it jerked to a stop? I wonder if it stalled. Wow. Maybe you can get somebody out there, a good Samaritan, and help him push it. <laughs> Zero cool two seven eight. Thank you for the twelve months. Been a member for a year and twenty days now. Thanks for the content, Mel. Thank you. Oh yep, I think, I think it's still no, nope, no, but didn't stall. He just wanted to be an annoyance. There you go. Why you gotta be so annoying? He's driving pretty slow now. I wonder if he's got, I wonder if he's running out of gas. Well, maybe that was his last hurrah. Going oh, slow now. Boop, 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 You know, you, any, any, most of you guys know that noise, you know, like where it's just, you know, it's, it's sucking that last bit of gas out there. But, seems like. This is a messed up story. I'm going to have to check it out. Somebody what said they told her to get out station. and come to the officer, How and then they all the unloaded oil? on her. Unlimited oil. Oh, uh, that's right. Yeah. What in the world is going on? I don't know. It's an older truck. I bet you probably could put it in neutral and then, you know try and start it. So I don't know why I put it in park. Going slow now. Yes, I'm not going to lose it. Walter, that's kind of mean. I, you know, I, I, I don't think that's what it is. I don't think that's what it is. I don't think that's what it is at all. Somebody's giving me the driver's name. Oh. Wow. I, you know, I try to stay away from bro because I used bro one time and then somebody got really mad at me. And then I, I try not to use bro. So... Anyways, continuing on there, you kind of got an idea what's going on. I can, th and my phone is trying to hook up back up to the internet, so maybe I can join you guys back in a little bit right here. But you can clearly see that vehicle just kind of moving along, trying to get that. Uh, I don't know why I didn't get gas. You should have stopped for gas. You think it's what it is? Low on gas? Something. Going to be moving though, right? Oh, I'm starting to sound like done. the passenger princess. You should have got gas. <laughs> I told you to get gas. All those times the guy was circling around the gas station, too. You probably could have pulled it off. Man, maybe. don't turn this into a standoff. That's not what we need right, right now. We might be here all night long. Oh, Kelly Jen says, you covered the story uh, before they just released the body these cam. people right really? here, too. Oh, look at the, another red Porsche. We saw one this morning. Um, yeah, these guys don't want to pass. And I wonder if they don't want to pass because I, w I wonder if, like, this guy is, like, watching us on the Internet yeah. and he's, like, doing the – got his phone out. There oh. he is. Okay. Dun, All right. Dun, 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 dun. Can we – yeah, 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 yeah. Go, 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 go. What's up with that? Oh, they've got other people. Everybody's running after him. 
scores. He, oh, no, he's coming back. He's coming back. He's in the backyards. He's in the backyards. A horrible time to break up. There's people running back. after him. Somewhere back. He's back over here. Oh. There he is. There he is. I just saw him cross this right here towards this building. Top the red, reddish, brownish clay color. Let me see if, I can, if we got to. Okay, here. We get to see what they're running over here. On hey, Cal. Hey, Cal, you can room. see him running. Oh, they're hugging him. Look, look, there he is. This is the. He jumped over. Sit down. Oh, shit. Yeah. They got his ass. Pedestrians. Siete. Siete. Let him go. No. Let him go. Please let him go. Oh, no, he's, he's a good guy. Let him go. No, no, no. He's this not is a good racist. Guy. Let Sorry. it go. Mama. Who's that? Mama? That's t she looked too young for Mama. Mama's love. I don't want to sit down. No. Siete. Getting a little heat. Getting a lot of heat. Oh, he's I getting love a you. from his girl. She's the one that probably was telling him, getting a lot of heat, if we can just do a pedal turn. Get your uh -oh. ass down. Is that uh -oh. a citizen uh -oh. or a cop? Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Those are cops. Get your ass down. They ain't even talking. She's putting her arms up, too, right or die. No, please, Jesus Cristo. Look at the guy recorded, too. He's like, get, get the good shot. All the other people. <laughs> just kind of shows you, though, the bad boys always get the cute girls. Look at that. Hmm. I don't look that cute to me. But. Or the ride or die. I don't know. You the know, ride or die. Yeah, the ride or die. Let's not get into physical beauty. But, I mean, come on. Yeah, I no, no. With already the, the two, two on um, plain clothes came up with guns. They took them down. Uh, they are the ones that took them into custody. And another one. Oh, that's a, <laughs> that's a media. I thought it was, an off, it was an officer with his cell phone out just to make sure that there's not, nothing going on. Not that there's in, no cameras on this. Anyway, this media pursuit coming to an end out here in the Alhambra area at the corner of Garfield and McLean. And McLean and McLean, that's what it says. And at any rate, you got uh, law enforcement arriving out there. He rode it till he ran out of gas, and then he got out and ran. Got a little exercise in, but uh, definitely in custody right now. Looks like some family members there to, uh, and to re reunite with him. And at least one... Uh, one guy that was uh, not a family member that was like, yeah, we're going to bring this to an end. A lady's crying, too. Is that mama? There you go. Did he, maybe he drove back to his, his his house. Maybe this is where he lived or something. That's, that was a girlfriend. That's mama up there crying. The car. That was a father. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's not how it works, man. Mama's love. That's not how it works. Look at, the, look, at, look, at, look at the officer. He's like, look, man. Get, get back in your van. No, you can't. You can't have any video of him. Why can't you have any video of him? We got plenty of video. Believe me. Believe me. Believe me. We got. We got video. We got video. Yeah. Mama. Mama's love. I gotta get that video so I can play it for you guys too. Mama's love. That guy not happy. He want. He wants a badge number. He wants a badge number. I want your badge number. Yeah. What's he so angry? Who's about? your supervisor? That's California people. They get All angry right. uh, when the criminals get arrested. That's why they always uh, let up. Well, let's get that POS out of the road so people can start driving again. Wow. Well. Hmm. Always go back home to mama. Oh, ABC on the ground right there. Right on the spot, too. Moral of the story. Listen to your passenger, princess, and get gas before mm. you go do do stuff like this. Was she in the Anyways, car? No, no, she wasn't in the car. Suspects in that vehicle. Oh, look at the car. Look at the, the camera. And it says, come to an end. Mama's love. Ain't nothing like mama's love. Still on KCAL copy. Thank you for telling me now. I was about, I uh, was thinking that this might have been done. All right, cool. Thank you. I'm going to stay with him till he gets out of the picture, and then we're going to go back to, yeah, he's going out, he's getting out of the picture. I'm going to go back to the car, if that's all right, and that, uh, that will end that. Get it out of the digital doubler. I want to see a replay of this guy running. <clears throat> You 
You're welcome. Anybody and everybody that's watching, thank you for the love today. Thank you, thank you. Uh, <laughs> and uh, Jim, Bob, Jim Bob, that's your pointlessly big camera that has worse quality than a phone, right? Stu, M-U-N-D-E-L, S-T-U, M-U-N-D-E-L, 1-L, and I'm not the, I'm not the beef stew, I'm the S-T-U. You can find me on the social media, Instagram, Facebook, and X. But uh, anyways, I'm going to find out from our assignment desk if we are going to hang out any longer. If not, thank you guys for watching. I always do appreciate it. Uh, sorry for those few moments there when I lost it. Sorry, man. Sorry. And I, I, I'm getting the private well, messages good. as well. I didn't know I could Stu's get that on here. Anyways, thank you guys. Thank you. And uh, we will chat with you all hopefully shortly. And uh, wow. Uh, let me find out what's going on. On the internet, right, and, da, 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 and he's oh, like he's doing the, got his phone out. There he is. Dun, da, da, dun, da, dun, 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 dun. Can we? Yeah, 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 yeah. Go, 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 go. Oh, they got. Let's see if they got a. They mess up over here too. For this one. Dun, 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 dun. Can we? Yeah, 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 yeah. Go, 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 go. Yeah, it did mess up for them. It's funny that Stu's on all these channels too. The news channels. Uh, I was trying to get one. There was one that it didn't. I think it was KTLA. It didn't break up. No, <laughs> no, NBC. Let's see, NBC. Uh, it, it, uh... Let's check out NBC. Quality is horrid, but you can see when he ran out. Really, no. That uh, something is up here, right. and uh, look how far behind they are uh, to the pursuit vehicle. So uh, yeah, that's kind of what I noticed uh, in another portion of this about unmarked. I just described. Yeah. Uh, there you go. Oh, well, well, he's out of the vehicle. Out and he's running. It looks like. Running. And uh, what made him do that? I don't know. Uh, making a right-hand ah, turn, going it through the yard over. here. Okay. Let's pull out of the shot here. This is off of McLean and uh, Garfield. Let's see. Looks like an officer. Do we have an un ground. undercover officer? Or a neighbor, a resident. So this is uh, McLean and Garfield, and this is yeah. certainly an area we've seen him in before. Yeah, we have, and uh, these might be undercover officers. You may have called that one, Carolyn. Let's see what happens here. We have not seen Can him shoot? pop out. We okay, Derek? Okay. Uh, we have not seen him pop out. And, oh, there he is. Here we go. Oh, look at this, look at this. So, I just I'm just speculating. I think this is Mama. Maybe this is the boyfriend. I don't know if that's about Dad. And this is the girlfriend. Okay. Uh, we have not seen him pop out. And oh, here we go. And he's trying to separate him. She's holding out. Please no. And there's Mama running. It's like some maybe some neighbors or or uh, neighbors. Yeah, maybe they just like they have him. Wow. Yeah, but, wow. Oh, he hit her, too. Wow. Oh, that, now, that is an interesting turn of events right there. A little bit of street justice Let him go, is what's happening. Please. Leave it to and the good residents of Alhambra yep. to take down this right? guy, They've right? They've probably been paying attention to this. Not in our neighborhood. Yeah. Uh, okay. Pedal turn right there, Derek. I'm getting some uh, exhaust fumes here. So, and a little bit of high five in there by the neighbors. And uh, I'm not sure if they're going to hold him. Hold on, guys, while we try and uh, reposition here, because we're getting uh, a lot of exhaust fumes from the chopper right here. I want you to see this very clearly. And it looks like we have officers we do now have on officers. scene. Yes, mm. officer, armed officers. And he is uh, assuming the position. Yeah. He is down with his arms behind his back. Well, wow, what a Hollywood ending to this yeah. one, right? So bizarre. Yeah, it's a good chase. Well, thankfully nobody got hurt because th this was really looking like somebody could have easily got run over or something like that. I was driving really erratic. Um, there is, there was this. Uh, I guess it's not happening anymore. I don't know. There's a, there was a Hollywood sign rescue. I guess somebody at the Hollywood sign in Cali. I don't know if that's still happening or not. I, I guess not. If he gets in the desert. What is this thing here? I don't wanna.
some music though. Man, California, San Francisco. Wow, we got a lot of issues there. I guess with the homeless people. All right, all right. Oh, they were on uh, streaming on Twitter too. Cool. Arkansas, thank you for the twenty-one months. Appreciate that. This dude was super annoying. Got other people. The Everybody's community. The community chair. Somebody said, "Yeah, what kind of chair is that?" Just yeah. running after him. We saw already. Oh, come kind of guys. <laughs> oh, he's going home. Oh, this dude's oh. having a blast. I cut it off. Let's see what Stu said. Nine, nine eight, four, oh. Yankee one, three, nine, nine, eight, four, Yankee <laughs> one. Doctor Edward Boskowitz, Julie, how you doing? It out. Love the people in your chat. Love Ford you, Matt. POS. Love you and Maddie too. Thank you. Are we clear? Thank you so much. Drug test, dude. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, guys, man. I'll be around. Um, if anything else breaking happens today, otherwise, I'm gonna, I got a couple things to do around the house and chill. But just make sure you uh f subscribe, subscribe to Ikid Mel Space CC. Uh, make sure you turn on all notifications. We have on on the fourth. This this Thursday it's gonna be busy. There's multiple hearings happening, so I'll definitely I'll be on. Uh tomorrow I have no idea what we're doing. I'll have to check a look and see, but it's gonna get busy soon. And then we got a trial, I think, in, in uh two weeks. Actually, I don't even I think actually next week is a trial. The contest, we're gonna do it on Friday. The con or the challenge. The challenge winners will do it Friday. <clears throat> I gotta set up a time, I gotta, I gotta talk to Mustard Mama. Again, thank you to Mustard Mamas. Thank you so much for the uh, 20 memberships. Jeez Louise, you're amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you guys for the support. I just got, I still got to clean it up a little bit. We just got from that road trip. I haven't, we haven't put nothing away. <laughs> All the little suitcases full, but. Oh, and the boys are back. I am going to post a video when I can, hopefully today, of when I, when the dogs, when I pick them up. Uh. All right. So love you guys. Take care. Going live on the eclipse. When is the eclipse? That's today?